Hi, this is John Morgan, and I am here to show you how to take your 2D elevations and 2D floor plans and turn them into the 3D images that you want to share with your clients. First step is to go to File and choose Preferences. In the Preferences section, you will find Work Area, and in Work Area, there are two options that apply to this. You have Display 3D Shapes and Floor Plan and Display 3D Shapes and Elevation. What that means is that you could make the Floor Plan 3D, the Elevation 3D, or both of them 3D, simply by putting check marks in the boxes to the left. Now let's take a look at our Floor Plan first. I'll put a check mark there, click Apply, and I'm going to move our dialog box over here to the left just a little bit. Now, when you see our floor plan, you'll notice instead of a basic 2D floor plan, you now have lots of detail, including the corner blocks, the hardware, the doors. You even see that the door is open on the sink base, and there's a couple of accessories over here on the right-hand side that have been pulled out, including a double wastebasket. Now, if you were like me, I typically do not show 3D floor plans. I like my floor plans to be nice and simple and easy to read. But my elevations, I much prefer to be 3D because that's where I'm going to show door styles, hardware placement, profiles on the frames, profiles on the center panels, lots of features right there on my elevation. I typically focus details to both my elevations and my perspectives. So let's take a look at how we would switch this so our elevation is 3D, but our floor plan is 2D. We would simply turn off the check mark next to floor plan, place one next to elevation, and click apply, and now you see the change. And if I click OK, what happens then? OK confirms my changes, not just for this drawing, but for every drawing we do from now going forward. It becomes my default. So tomorrow, if I lay out a brand new floor plan and I open up an elevation, it will automatically look like this elevation, including all the details on the doors, the profiles, and even where the hardware is. Now, you're interested in actually sharing this, not just on your screen, but actually providing this as output to your client. How would we do that? We would go to File, go to Print, and click on Print Preview. Now, if you're familiar with print in 2020, you know we print in what's called WYSIWYG. What you see is what you get. So since your floor plan is 2D and your elevation is already 3D, all you have to do is determine whether you're sending this to a printer or to a PDF to share digitally and click OK. And you'll notice that your floor plan is 2D, but when I go to the next page, my elevation is 3D, showing all the details that I want to share with my client. Now keep in mind, when we make this change through preferences, this becomes your default. So all of your output from this point forward on your plans will automatically be set up exactly to your preferences. For other great ideas, please join the 2020 community at www.2020spaces.com forward slash community.